this video shows you different ways that you can use the California resin flux. California is probably the best flux that there is, bar none. It does not give off noxious fumes. Some people even think that the fumes are pleasant. It performs well as a flux and is also an excellent insulator. This insulation property can be very useful when working on circuit boards and repairing such things as phones and motherboards. It comes in a can that is probably one of the most difficult cans to get open. After struggling with the can, you find an amber-colored resin. Mine is well used, so it looks a bit rough. There are several ways to use this. I am going to work with some fine wire, which I will be using to connect Christmas light LEDs to add to my models. I have to tin the tips. You can see the process of adding these Christmas light LEDs in another video of mine. You simply lay the wire on the California, touch it with your soldering iron, and then touch it with the solder. This is just fast and easy. I generally don't use this process myself. I find there are better ways to do it. You can see it in, in, uh, later on in the video. Now, another way to do this is to first put some solder on the tip of your iron. I'm cleaning iron tip off. Put some solder on the tip of your iron and then touch that in the flux. And then you can go ahead and tin the tip of the wire. That is a, another uh, way to do it. Then we can move on from there and touch the uh, tip in the California first and then touch the solder I don't, I don't like this too much, because, uh, again, uh, it is too many, too many evolutions here, too many steps, but it works. Some people use that, you know, when they're working with barrel boards and PC boards, they'll, 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 they'll touch the California, touch the solder, whatever. This is my favorite way. I make liquid flux from the California. See my other video linked below on how to do it. I just go ahead. Dip the wire into the liquid flux, <coughs> and bang, I've got a nice solder joint. I have a lot more on soldering and working with brass in my channel. Please subscribe, and there are other links below. Have a good day.